an infantry person, being running around behind a GPS input through DF to catch all the militants. I have gone around every place being misled by this GPS. And uh, so they made us run hell here and there, there and here. Because system was made for France, tested in France. When I went and saw the SSG Thompson systems, they written tested verified in France. What is France? What is India? Elena Geosystems, a Bengaluru-based space technology firm, unveiled a chip on April 13th that could form the core of satellite navigation, positioning and timing applications in India. On the third and final day of the Dev Space Symposium, organized by the Indian Space Association at the United Services Institute in New Delhi, Elena Geosystems founder, Colonel Velen, handed over the chip to Chief of Defence Staff General Anil Chauhan in the presence of DRDO Chairman Dr. Samir V. Kamath and Chief of Air Staff Air Chief Marshal Vivek Ram Chaudhary. Air Vice Marshal D.V. Khot, DG, Defence Space Agency and Nitin Gokhale, founder of Interstellar.News were also present. This chip works seamlessly with the Indian constellation Navik or the Indian Regional Navigation Satellite System satellites. Hailing this as a major step towards Atmanirbharta, Colonel Valen said the processor would allow both the government and private sector companies to shed their dependence on American global positioning system. In Navik, we don't want DGPS. DGPS solutions give you 10 meter accuracy at the maximum, if you see it. If you see the, the fine print written on it. Whereas our system gives you less than 1 meter accuracy. We have achieved it. The chip has many cores that service the requirements of signal acquisition, regeneration, processing and the output interface and hence it has been named as the Navic processor. Navic has very high availability, accuracy, reliability and integrity and it operates both in L and S bands. That's another advantage. And S band suits for Indian terrain, especially the mountains and the seas and also L band accuracy as compared to S band is much lower. The military-grade chip or processor can be used in a wide array of applications on land, air and water. For the Defence Forces, the chip can be used in handheld devices, for operational logistics, in ships, submarines, radars and drones and artillery weapons and weapons platforms. As I look at you, you all are the users. And as users, this is the critical moment where we have to change and move from being GPS driven to Navic driven. Elena has, over the last two years, successfully demonstrated its capability across devices and applications for reference stations, marine Navic receivers, intelligent vehicle tracking devices, Navic drone navigation units, and Navic based atomic clock. The Navic chip is the latest addition to its bouquet that uses 12 nanometer technology. As India moves ahead with its space policy, this is indeed an opportune time to use a truly Indian product. With Divya Tripathi, Karan Marwaha and Nilanjana Banerjee for Interstellar.news.